Okay, very good. I have to now go to my um, the 19th index additive prime. These are those classes of, of prime numbers that are um, if you add the index to the to the prime itself, you get another prime number. And so the 19th one happens to be 619. Okay, so the 19th index additive prime is 19, which is prime number 98 plus 521 is equal to 619. And immediately from this equation that I wrote here, Surah 19 has 98 verses. my apologies this is uh, these spam spam calls that we receive um, surah 19 has 98 verses we know about these but I'm just trying to remind you and then I'm going to tell you some new stuff here that we didn't know and and it is amazing okay so <clears throat> 19 times 521 is 9899 9899 is the sum of the frequencies of Aleph plus Lam plus Mim in Surah 2. 619 is the 114th prime, and 114 is the number of surahs in the Quran. So I'm going to write these down, and the first <coughs> row here are the primes, and the second row are the indices of those primes. 521 has index 98. If you add it up, you're going to get 619. 619 is, is index is 114. You add up 614, I'm sorry, 619 plus 114, you're going to get 733. And this index is 130, prime number 130. You add 130 to, one, to 733, you're going to get 6, I'm sorry, 863 with an index of 150. And then finally, you're going to get 1013 if you add 150 plus uh, 863, you're going to get 113, I'm sorry, 1013, which has an index of 170. This, the indices have a unique property. 98 composite is 130, 114th composite is 150, 130 composite, 150, one thirtieth composite is one seventy. This is this is a very unique property of this series. This is the largest index additive prime series. So it's the longest one. There is no other one in mathematics that you keep adding it and it becomes another prime. Okay. Ten thirteen is the last prime. And it happens to be the ninety twin Gaussian composite. We didn't know this before. So you see, this is, this is God who sees all. Okay? So, in this table, you can either start from left to right or from right to left. Based on 19, you are going to get to, to all these parameters of the Quran. It is amazing, huh? Okay, so... 1013 also happens to be the last prime, as I said, and it is the 83rd Gaussian composite. And 80, 83rd composite happens to be 114, which is the number of surahs in the Quran. 83 also happens to be the 19th Chen prime. Okay? Now, if I add 170 to, 130, to 1013, I'm going to get 1183, which is not a prime anymore. But, 1183 is a composite, and this index is 988, and Surah 98 has eight verses. Okay, by the way, 988 is 19 times 52. Okay, which 
which I didn't put it down here, but it's all right. 1183 is a composite, this index is 988, and Surah 98 has eight verses. 1183rd composite happens to be 1406, which happens to be 19 times 74, and Surah 74 is where 19 is mentioned, actually. That is amazing. And as I said, 988 is 19 times 52, and 52 happens to be the index of 74. The index of composite 74 is 52. See, all of these things are meshing together and creating the Quran, generating the Quran. Okay. So when he tells us in, in 67, that this is how we should behave, this is how we should we should. We should conduct our lives. We should lead a righteous life. That's what we are here for. That's why we are being, being distinguished. So, the important thing for us is that to obey God's commandments and do not waste our lives. Because this is something that God gave us from his, his own attribute. Life is sacred. You cannot kill a soul. God tells us that. So with all of these things that goes on, do you think that we're going to succeed if we keep doing this? We're not going to succeed. We are going to fail. He says that had God willed, this would this do this or that. Okay. Is, if it is according to God's will, do we, do we go along with God's will or not? God's will is his law. When he said, thou shalt not kill, he meant it. That's his will. So if somebody kills somebody, that person is not going to succeed, no matter what kind of excuse you're going to make for that person. Get the best lawyer and this and that, the others. It's not going to work out. So according to that righteous life that we have to lead, we have to do it, and we have to abide by it, then we are going to make right decisions. We are going to make, we are going to be on the side of God. And it doesn't matter what kind of sin we have, we have done before, God forgives you. But you cannot continue justifying your, your bad deeds. If we go according to God's will, we are going to succeed. If we don't do that, we are going to, we are going to fail cannot violate God's laws. Okay? This is that last week we read about that you should use good language, proper language. So if somebody doesn't use proper language, do you think that person is going to succeed? If cussing and things are going in the in the in the conversation between two people, do you think they're going to succeed? We can't whine and complain that, oh, why this is bad things are happening to this and that and the others. It would happen because they're breaking God's laws. If they don't do that, then they're going to succeed. They're going to be respected. They're going to have a happy life. Okay, they understand it. They understand the universe better. They will not, be, will not be lost in this, in this maze of things that they create for themselves. So we have to go back to God, turn back to God, and worship Him alone. Believe in Him alone. Don't believe anybody else, just believe God alone. 
and then you're going to succeed. There's no other way. That's God's promise. Okay, and God never breaks a promise. Okay, I'm going to stop here and I'm going to finish up. Joma, I'm not going to get here. Subhan Rabbi al Adim, Allah al Kabir, Allah al Kabir. Subhan Rabbi al Adha, Allah al Kabir, Allah al Kabir. Subhan Rabbi al Adha, Allah al Kabir. Ashhadu an la ilaha illa Allah, Allah al Kabir. بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم الحمد لله رب العالمين الرحمن الرحيم مالك يوم الدين إياك نعبد وإياك نستعين اهدنا الصراط المستقيم صراط الذين أنعمت عليهم وعيد لما قضوا عليهم ولن أعوم الله الكبير سبحان ربي العظيم الله الكبير الله الكبير سبحان ربي العظيم الله الكبير سبحان ربي الأعلى الله الكبير الله الكبير 